Okay, now what do you notice about this? It's the 10. Yeah, 5 plus 5, we circle our 5 plus 5, is also the same as 10. Okay, so what do we do with this? We close here. Yeah, because we've already used that. Okay, now, now what do we have left? A plus 5 plus 5, plus 5 plus 5. Yeah, so we have our plus 5 plus 5 plus 5. Let's take Gracie. Um, just a little bit longer. Now, what do you notice about this? <laughs> yeah, there's another ten in there. So it's our five plus five. So we can go ahead and make this a ten, right? <laughs> and then we move down our ten plus, right? So it's ten plus ten. Then we can go ahead and cross the five plus five out. Now, look, we still got something left over. So it's plus five. And we already know what 10 plus 10 is, right? 20. Yes. So 20, and then we just move our plus 5 down. So I'll let you do that. It's 20. And then we move our plus 5 down. So it's 20. 5. No, 20 plus 5 is 25. Yeah, 20 plus 5. He had the right answer. 25. So, he was finishing your sentence. Yeah. So let's see that last square get filled in, and then I want to see a big smile. Good job! And that's the story of how I taught Alice to <laughs> multiply. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, multiplication is good for your brain. <laughs>